it's Bonnie. I am back. My strawberry head is gone. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was a fun video this morning talking about strawberry pound cake. But today I finally organized an Easter video. I feel like Easter is early this year, even though it's not. It's April 4th, but um, I'm feeling kind of unprepared for Easter. I've bought like bits and pieces of stuff, and I wanted to show you my Easter coffee bar, which I just realized today I need to buy coffee. You'll see that in the video. <laughs> and then um, I wanted to give you a really simple idea for Easter using Bath and Body Works products. So a couple places that are really good to go to to get Easter stuff for inexpensive Easter stuff. First of all, Kohl's. Oh my gosh, they have this shirt, Hip Hop Hooray. I love this shirt. It's super cute. I'm going to wear this on Easter. Um, I like the little bunny ears. I like the gray. I don't know. I just think it's really cute. So I got this shirt. I was super happy with my Easter shirt. And then, as far as gift ideas, Dollar Tree, all these Bath and Body Works. That's all you need for Easter. Seriously. Um, I actually had a plan to bring on more Easter candy, but somebody ate it. <laughs> actually, it was a combination. So last weekend, I went to Aldi's. They have a ton of Easter candy. Um, very inexpensive. Lots of good stuff. Uh, we got these little, um, like, eggs. They're gone. The whole family just, like, devoured them. They're, they're, they're gone. <laughs> so I need to sneak out to Aldi alone this week and hide the Easter candy until um, Easter Sunday. So here's what I got for you. This is awesome. So actually, this Easter basket I've had for a couple of years. I think I bought this one at Michael's. I think it's pretty. I like the lace on it. Um, and then what I do is I got the Easter grass at Dollar Tree. One dollar, super easy. I got the Easter eggs at Dollar Tree. I like to fill eggs, even though my daughter's 14. I think it's fun. Um, and I like the, the shiny ones the best. I think they're awesome. And then usually what I do is I, I don't usually like hide an Easter basket anymore. <laughs> what I do is I actually let her fix it up. Um, but like sometimes I'll give my like nieces and nephews an Easter gift. So I wanted to give you guys some ideas for Easter. By the way, they do have uh, chocolate pudding peeps. Somebody already broke into these though and started eating them. I got to get some more. Uh, the chocolate pudding peeps are amazing. I actually like them better than the regular peeps because I'm not a huge fan of peeps. By the way, did you see they have Pepsi? Uh, peeps Pepsi. Um, but you can't buy it. You have to post a photo on Instagram and then you can win it. I'm like, what, what, what will they come up with next? <laughs> like, peeps Pepsi. I'll put a screenshot up. Um, but anyway, what I did in here, this is a really good idea for Easter. So I got these at Dollar Tree, um, obviously a dollar. And then Bath and Body Works has done all the work for you this year. So all you got to do is buy the Happy Easter uh, Sweet Bunny Berry Shower Gel. One of the hand creams. You don't have to get the hand cream if you don't want to, because it's probably less expensive if you just get the little minis. Um, the Happy Easter, which I love the color purple, Sweet Bunny Berry, and then they have a body cream. So all you got to do is put a little Easter grass in this cute little basket from Dollar Tree, um, put your products in here, and you've got an adorable, like, non-candy uh, gift for someone uh, that's super cute. I mean, you can give this to a teenager, a kid, an adult. Just about anyone is going to love this. So, I mean, this is going to run you probably, um, for the products, even if you don't do the hand cream, you're talking about, because it's buy two, get one free, so about, you know, 13 bucks for under $15 if you don't do the hand cream. If you add the hand cream in, it's going to be under 20 um, But this is a super cute idea for like, a, you know, non-candy. And you can actually set that in your Easter basket and it takes up some room so you're not, um, you know, filling the whole thing with candy, <laughs> which I tend to do. So I'm actually going to, I took some video footage of my um, uh, coffee bar that I'm going to show you right now. So this is the coffee bar. I don't change up um, like the coffee sign or the home is where you drop your anchor. I just basically for the holidays change up some of the decor. So I do have two shelves here that I've got some cute Ray Dunn pieces and I've got 
um, the little guy there, the stuffed animal with the cute little carrot. <laughs> I've got a sugar bowl. Of course, I've got my Bath and Body Works single wicks. Those are really cute to decorate with. I think those really brought the coffee bar together this year. Um, so I've got that. And then where the actual coffee makers are, I've got my Bath and Body Works light up Easter egg from last year. I've got some cute little carrots that I got at Michael's. And I was going to get some Easter plates, which I didn't get this year. There's my candles. <laughs> I realized I have to buy coffee, too. I'm like, what the heck? Look, I'm out of coffee. <laughs> I'm like, holy moly, I've got hot chocolate and like three coffees left. So that reminded me that I actually need to buy coffee. Um, but this is just another view coming back in where I keep my tea. And then, um, like I said, I think it's a really um, cute setup. I just, every season I change these out. I love the little bunny kisses jar there. And um, like I said, I'm especially fond of the, um, the single wick. So this is just taking it back again. Um, to show you the whole thing, I'm zooming out. I do have uh, two coffee makers. I use one for tea and one for coffee. So the coffee, uh, the tea doesn't taste like coffee. <laughs> so that's the coffee bar. And then next to my coffee bar, kind of around the corner, I have a baker's rack um, where I keep a lot of my Ray Dunn mugs. And I've got Love My Peeps. I love these. I love the um, brightly colored... Um, the, the inside of the cup. I think that's so pretty with the blue and the orange. And then, of course, I have six of my Easter-themed uh, Bath & Body Works candles, so I can just grab one um, and burn it when I want to. But I really love those two sets. Of course, the Banana Bun Cake is one of my absolute favorites. I burn that one a lot. But I really, um, I really like the Easter colors. I think everything kind of came together really pretty. I think it was... Um, I think it was a nice setup this year. I'm happy uh, for Easter. Uh, I, I feel like I'm ready with the coffee bar. <laughs> and then, of course, we have the Easter basket that I just showed you. I just wanted to show you again um, kind of the inside of it, what I did. It looks really cute. So oh, that is the coffee bar. Super exciting. I'm like so happy that I got everything done. I feel like I'm more um, organized now. And I actually, I went in the kitchen and I did find one of the um, Aldi's uh, Easter candy selections that there's only one left. <laughs> Check it out. They look like this. They're actually really good. They're vanilla and cocoa wafer eggs, plain in dark chocolate coated. Um, I seriously need to get to Aldi. If I get in there, I might do an Aldi haul and show you guys what I got, but they got lots of good stuff. Um, all of my Ray Dunn does come from either Home Goods, TJ Maxx, or Marshalls. And honestly, I have not been in there very much at all this year. I think I went once, like three weeks ago, but I feel like the supply and the demand has increased exponentially since the pandemic for the Ray Dunn things. Like, I couldn't even find anything when I went, like, a couple of weeks ago. I know people go in there and they all, they buy it all up and then they sell it on Macari, so it's really hard for just the average collector sometimes to get in there and find a piece, but if you can find it, it's usually a good deal. Like, I got this jar, I want to say maybe, like, two years ago, it was like, I think it was like $9.99, $10.99. So they're, they're pretty, um, you know, a good deal if you can find them. So every season I do try and get like maybe one or two extra Ray Dunn pieces to add to my holiday coffee bars. I usually do the coffee bar. I usually do um, an Easter one. Then what I do for spring and summer is I just keep pretty much keep it the same for spring and summer. I bring out a lot of my beachy stuff. And then um, fall, of course, is the time that I usually decorate more. I'll do like a Halloween themed coffee bar. And then of course, um, a Christmas themed one. Um, I don't really have a lot of Valentine's Day pieces. I have a couple things. And then I do have some cute St. Patrick's Day mugs. Um, but I, I actually didn't get around to filming that. But I did set those out this year. So I don't know. I think it's festive. I've always enjoyed doing that. And then, um, like I said, t-shirt. Hip Hop Hooray is from Kohl's. I love this t-shirt. It's so comfortable and it's cute. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. Hit the subscribe button. I will be back. Bye-bye.